and we're back and this time I'm going to show you how to use presets in Adobe Lightroom. Got a new image, you can find that via description link below. Before I go to the edit, I want to crop it a little bit and I uncheck this lock icon so that I can freely transform it. Maybe up to here, that should be fine. I press enter and I'm automatically in the edit menu. Press E if you're not. Could use auto. I don't like the results, but we've got presets down here. Simply left click on it. And now we've got this default menu. You can click on the settings, hide partially compatible presets, which shouldn't be of your concern when you've got the defaults. Let's go to manage and we'll uncheck one, vignetting, and if we go back it's gone. So when you've got a lot of presets imported that might be helpful, but when you've got the defaults it's no problem. You've got enough overview. You can also create your own, but let us play with the ones that we've got. If you hover over them, they are automatically applied. Let me open the light menu and you can see the sliders. They are automatically adjusted by the presets. And if I select one, for example, this, this one under color, and I go to the creative ones and, and let me pick this red lift. And if I click on it, you can see the one under color is now deselected. So if a preset uses the same sliders and settings that a previous one has used, the previous one is deactivated. But under curve, grain, sharpening and vignetting, we can add further effects. So if I add a light grain, the lighting sliders aren't affected. So you can combine these presets with each other. And I definitely want to have a vignette but not a strong one, I'll stick to the light one. And I want to make it a little bit lighter. Uh, let me increase the exposure manually. So you can always adjust the presets manually afterwards. For example, like this, if I increase the exposure. And this is how you can use the presets in Adobe Lightroom. Let's compare it to the original. That's a quick effect, quickly done. Perfect for beginners. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.